what's going on everyone i thought i'll start out this morning with a vlog basically showing you guys what i got going on in my yard um so today i got a lot going on we're going to be doing um putting some lime down in the front yard doing some edging in the front yard doing a little mowing in the front yard and in the backyard we're going to be doing uh we're going to be putting down some uh some aeration that's what we're gonna do we're gonna do some aerating in the back liquid aerating in the back um so we got a lot going on today uh short period of time so we're gonna be doing all of that excuse my shirt guy this is one of my i think every guy got every woman man whoever got one of these raggedy t-shirts they just put on that feels real good they don't want to let it go so this is what this is <clears throat> excuse me so we got a lot going on today uh, so i thought i'd show you guys what i'm doing in my front yard i'm actually doing some watering this morning and um trying to get the uh, my front yard a little bit damp before i put on this lime because you want to make sure you put it on a damp lawn uh for those of you who don't know again i got a ph problem in the front after i did my soil test uh early this year so that's what we're doing in the front uh in the back we got some stuff going on as well so um so yeah so again i think i thought i started off this morning with a vlog um and for those of you who don't know i'm also doing some product testing for another channel that i just started so i'll put a link in the description over there if you guys want to check that channel out please subscribe to both channels again we're trying to get both channels uh subscription up uh so please subscribe if you're watching this video if you find my content very helpful please subscribe we really will appreciate it you're helping the channel out uh, but again i have a link to the um to my other channel over there that i'm doing some product discrimination uh description <laughs> sorry about that I'm doing some product testing on uh, i've always get that mixed up i always say the wrong word when i say product description but um uh, so guys check those channels out and i'm gonna show y'all what i'm doing in the front and so i got my sprinkler going right now and basically getting a little water down on my yard before i put some uh, stuff down on my front yard um like i said in the video if you haven't checked out my video from yesterday please check that out I'll put a link in the description for that as well. I kind of ran through a lot of stuff real quick because we got in kind of late and I wanted to make sure I get I got the uh, humic acid down before the sun went uh, settled. And I also got a little water in there. But this is the front yard right now. Still looking good. And so a lot of people ask me about my side yard and why I don't show it as much. And I'm going to show you guys why I don't show it a lot. And mainly for two reasons. One is I do put, a lot, put some attention to it, but I don't put as much attention to it, but I need to start. But two is because of neighbors. So that's the reason why I don't really show it as much as, as often as I should on this side of my house is because um, in previous videos, I was going to take on this lawn, but the company and I couldn't decide on a price and we decided to just end it because he had people coming in and moving in. This is a, that was a rental house over there. And um, he said he was going to have them to take care of the lawn. And as you can see, they have not did anything. And... For most people, I kind of hate to say it the way I'm saying it, but if it ain't their house, they're not going to take much care of it. So that's the reason why I really hadn't did much to that yard and uh, to my side yard. But I, I do have a little barrier, as you see, uh, going over, the, uh, over that so that uh, I do have that kind of cutoff where their yard starts and my yard starts. So the weeds that they had won't come over into my yard. So this is that Palisades oil on the side. This is really taking in really well. So you can see that. All right, guys. So we're in my backyard now. And in the back, again, like I said before, um, we're going to be doing some... Uh, liquid aerating as soon as the truck comes we're gonna be putting that down uh here 
in my backyard. For those of you who hadn't seen my video yesterday, please check that out again. Um, there's a lot of information I got down in a short period of time. So uh, very helpful for those of you who uh, have dry spots and stuff in your lawn. Um, it'd be very helpful for you. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna show you guys my backyard right quick. <laughs> all right so that's the backyard this morning i don't know if you guys can tell yesterday over here um uh, it was all dry all dry uh after putting down the um humic and watering it in pretty good you can definitely tell a change already still a little dry in some areas but that'll take care of itself um so yeah, it was dry all over yesterday. So that's the backyard. And um like I said, like I said before, we're gonna be doing some liquid aerating back here as soon as the uh, UPS truck bring my uh, liquid aerating from Simple Lawn Solution. And uh, we're gonna put that down uh today. So you only can want to put that down twice a year, no more than three times, but really twice a year. If you're going to do any type of liquid area, twice a year, no more than twice a year. Um, so we're going to put that down. This is going to be our second time doing it. Uh, so guys, make sure you subscribe. Sorry about that, my dog. Make sure you subscribe for that as well. All right, guys.